Here we go. Just pull on that pipe in just a second. Not yet. Hang okay. on. You don't see any flames, do you? No flames. Good. Hot though. Here we go. Whoa. Watch out. We're okay. I got it. No, no, no. I got it. I was ready. Right on. Boom, fire. Had to grab that extinguisher. I had to move in a second and put that fire out. What that was was a little bit of oil. Yeah. And it's kind of normal to come out of there. Were you just like testing me? No, that scared the crap out of me. Okay. <laughs> okay, scared the crap out of me too. It would not have been good to have the roof catch fire with the chairman and CEO of Diamond Resorts on it. Oh crap, dude. What? I clamped it. You smashed the heck out of it. What do you want? You tell me to do that. No, I told you to pull it up. Now we got to replace this line. All right, well. And I don't have any. I'll maybe pick one up on my way home tonight. This you said make... grab it. You remember that fire? I remember I that. I jumped on that Thank fire. You. Thank you, Jack. Thank okay, you. Okay, well, so I smashed it at the same time. <laughs> That's OK. So I just blew it. Like, the gym's going to be hot longer. Uh, yeah. Things happen, man, when you're learning, and, and that's OK. You make it. You make you it. <laughs> yeah. All right, we got to go fix some light fixtures in the bathroom. Cool. Listen, this is like a big fear of mine. I'm doing it. Can't see where my feet are going. Jack, it's just a ladder. You can do it. Come on, buddy. Left foot, right foot, man. I do right foot, left foot. <laughs> If Jack wants to do this and, and uh, turn out to be a maintenance guy, he's going to have to man up a little bit. So where are you from? Oh, I've lived down here for about four years. Moved down from Flagstaff. Did you grow up there? No, no. No, just been there for about 30 years, though. I had a business in Flagstaff, RV repair business. and What happened to that? Well, I sold it. We were, it was very successful. Yeah. Young couple came in, and we're looking for a business to get into, and so we sold it. Oh, that's great. And then they just filed bankruptcy. Oh my God, so you're left with. So, nothing. how much did they owe you? Uh, about 240000 And was planning on that for retirement. So you had to go back to work. That's what we're doing. <laughs> so, is your wife working too? She is. She's Where's a school she working? teacher. She's a teacher, but she's working at Home Depot. She took a second job there. And I uh, got another job also. I work uh, UPS unloading trucks in the mornings. You have two jobs? Oh, yeah. Trying to get things back in order, it kind of kind of threw us for a loop. Randy, I had so much fun with you, you almost killed me. <laughs> we had a close call there. Whoa. You have such a great attitude. We have to take care of our guests. That's, that's our number one. We, I know, and you get it. Without them, we have nothing. Where are you living now? Living in Cottonwood. We moved down there about four years ago um, when things you know, went south in Flagstaff. You have a mortgage? We do have a mortgage. What's your mortgage? About 150000 probably. $150,000? Yeah. You told me about that bad business deal you made, and you're hurting. So I'm going to pay off the mortgage. Oh. Diamond Resorts is going to take care of that. You've taught me so much. <laughs> and I'm going to give you $50,000 in cash. Words. It's an unbelievable breath of fresh air. He's paying off our mortgage. He's giving us fifty thousand dollars cash. Oh, hey. We don't. You don't have to work two jobs anymore. Tell him thanks. <laughs> I will tell him thanks. Hey.